Hey butterflies, it's your girl Pam. We are here for our third infusion. Today is February 18th, 2022. So get ready to head in here. I've got an eight o'clock, it's about 10 till. So um, I just kind of wanted to jump on here and say good morning, good morning, good morning. And by the grace of God, we are still here. <laughs> So, um, I don't think I have to get all three medicines today. Of course, I have to get my pre-meds and get my blood drawn. But I don't think I have to do my, um, my, um, ketona, ketone, whatever it is. I don't think I have to do that third one today. Um, I think I do that one every three weeks. So, we'll hit that one next week. So, I only have two. Hopefully, I'll be out of here uh, by 12 30 one o'clock hopefully um so i just wanted to before um i go any further i just wanted you guys to know that i don't care if you're going through cancer i don't care if you're going through financial stuff or relationship or you know at work or family i want you guys to be mindful that you are able to pick and choose who's in your life and sometimes you have to just ask God to reveal who's for you and who's for, against you and it doesn't mean it in a bad way it just means that their season is over you know and you know three words that I knew that were my lessons in all of this one was surrender. Uh, I'm not used to people helping me. It's very hard for me to allow people to to help me. There's been people that's cashed out to me. There's people that have um, even just saying a prayer for me. It's hard for me to digest that. Care packages from Amazon, deliveries at my house, um, food being delivered um cooking for me and my family it's hard for me um but the what i had to learn was is that by me um not being acceptable or not accepting let me put it that way not accepting their um blessing that they're giving me i'm blocking their blessing because they i'm not allowing them to be obedient um sorry for that i didn't realize that background noise the heater was on but so with that in mind you know i had to say this is the season that you're going to need help you're gonna need help and it's okay um be humble be gracious be thankful um, I get cards in the mail. Um, I get emails um, with inspirational things in it, text messages. I get people that I don't even have a clue, y'all, that are praying for me. So I'm so blessed. I'm so blessed. The other one was patience. Um, I, I'm not one that has a lot of patience. Um, you know, I'm very much a black and white type person you know it, there's no gray area but after dealing with um, my daughter that has bipolar disorder um, I had to learn that there is a gray area and it's not always going to fit in one box or the other and so sometimes you have to give and so me learning to be patient um, um, it, but you know when you you're you're being taught a lesson, you know you're gonna get a you know a test, right? That's the only way that you can have a testimony is if you have a test. So, with that in mind, <laughs> I had to kind of learn that okay, just be there. It's okay. It's all right. And then thirdly was awareness. Awareness. Um, awareness was that the last one that I um, got sent to me that I was going to have to learn. Not everybody in your life is supposed to stay. Not everybody in your life that you thought were 
on your side, it's supposed to be there. Um, and when people teach you who they are, believe them. Believe them. No harm, no foul. You don't have to get mad. That's who they are. Um, you don't have to be, you know, uh, wish anything wrong. Um, you wish them well. And you send them on their way. And it's okay to do that. Um, things that keep coming up in my, my spirit is block your gateways. Um, Sometimes the enemy comes in, a, in in situations where you think it's through your family or your friends or, um, you know, people you work with. It could come in any form of fashion. Somebody you laying your, beside you. <laughs> it could come in any form of fashion. But the fact of the matter is you have to realize when it's time to let people go. And it's okay. Like I said, please do not wish anybody any ill will. But if you don't find out when you're feeling sometimes like you're in the pit of hell of going through your darkest hour and if you can't figure out that that person is for you then you gotta let them go you gotta let them go um because that's the time that you need people the people that are really there for you that's when you find out who they are so there you go butterflies you um We'll check in later and tell you guys how it went. But other than that, you have a wonderful, wonderful Friday. Okay, guys, I'm in. Um, I just got my port done. And so, um, they'll come in in a minute and ask me about any side effects. And then hopefully we'll go ahead and go to the infusion room and get started. All right. Peace. All right, butterflies, infusion three is over. We are headed home. I'm going to stop and get me something to eat and then try to go and relax. So, um, I told you I would probably be peep back on here. So, if you haven't already done so, please subscribe. Give it a like. It definitely helps out my channel. Um, and not necessarily for me. I just wanted to be able to get out to other people that may be going through this and feel alone. So, um, we've got to get the word out. So please subscribe. Make sure you hit the like button. Make sure that you hit the notification button. And until next time, love you butterflies. Oh, it took me, I got here at eight o'clock, got on the machine at nine and it is 1145. So, and I'm in my car, so not bad. All right. Take care. Bye-bye.